Do you like my personality glasses? Does it give me personality? Probably not. Okay. Hey YouTube, welcome back to my channel. I am back with a new video and today's video is about technology. It is about how I transitioned from iPhone 5 to iPhone X. I don't know what's happening right now. If any of you know me, I am part of the if it ain't broke don't fix it when it comes to technology. Like I will use whatever I have, especially technology wise, until it's dead. It really has to affect me daily in order for me to change it. So every time there's a new iPhone that has come out since the 5 has come out, I haven't really cared because it took me so long to get the 5 that I didn't need all of the coolness and plus supersizing the phone. Like I didn't care. I was completely happy with this phone. Only thing that frustrated me was that I kept running out of room. I listen to a lot of podcasts so that was taking up a lot of my space plus any pictures or videos that I wanted to take I would always have you know storage full especially when I was at Essence Fest I was just like I need to record the launch make more room if you knew me in college I had a phone I couldn't remember I had I still had like my I think I still had the flip phone and it would go like white like the screen would just go white and it wouldn't do anything and I would just throw the phone across the room um, they called it the crystal phone um, and every time your phone messed up they'd be like oh you got that crystal phone but even after I got I think like I got an iPhone 3 or something I don't remember but I was just like as long as it works I have my own camera which is what I'm filming with right now that I use for professional photos so I didn't care I didn't need like all of the the portrait mode which is oh it's dope like I'm just gonna I'm not gonna lie I'm a little bit annoyed that I have like this expensive camera when I have this now as far as like the update um I I think I updated to 10 and then I was like girl no because every time I had to update I had to delete like all of my pictures all of my videos all of my music and there's just so many new things on here that I didn't realize <laughs> I can't even think of the list right now because there was I just I didn't care it just wasn't a big deal to me like again I don't have to be in line for the newest iPhone every time they make one because it's not that big of a deal to me I have the iPhone 10 or X I guess X 10 whatever is dope the face ID is pretty cool I will say um, however I just I'm still getting used to it like I keep not having a home button has been difficult for me I keep making screenshots of the home screen and I don't even know how I'm doing that I have like 17 of the same picture this phone was like constantly slow so the whole like oh Apple makes your phone slow when a new phone comes out girl I wouldn't have known because <laughs> most of the time like it was slow and I just had the patience I don't like I said I didn't care so I don't have those complaints like everyone else has because I just I don't know it's not that big of a it wasn't a big of a deal to me I love that I can download whatever I have enough space for it I think I have like 200 something gigs so that's awesome this portrait mode ain't nothing to play with like you need to be on your game you need to be in tip-top shape you need to be able to, you know, find the lighting. I mean, I'm able to actually see stuff. Um, it, it's just funny every time, like, I do something on this phone. I'm like, what is, like, what is this? And people are like, girl, that was in the last update. You weren't, where were you? And I'm just like, I was asleep. It's fine. I like it. I don't have a problem. But again, I'm pretty sure they're coming out with iPhone 10.2 or 11, 13. I'm going to be content with this and that's that's pretty much it. I'm not going to say like I have to have the iPhone whatever that comes out next because I just got this one girl and I'm trying to get used to it so please feel free to judge me. I have no problems living in my truth now. I was an iPhone 5 user for years okay 
it took me a while to let go. We've been through the fire, Shaka Khan says, and I love this phone. So if you're the type of person that hangs on to technology every bit that you can, please comment below and let me know. Thank you for watching. Please comment, like, and subscribe to this channel, and I will see you guys next time. Peace. Being able to like people's comments or like your text messages, you were able to like or like exclamation point or whatever, or like send noises. I, with this phone, was not able to see any of that. It would literally say like, Susie liked a message or like Brian loved the message. So when I got this phone and my friends were liking comments, I was just like, that's what it looks like. Oh my God, that is so exciting. I'm so happy. I can see that. I can see what y'all doing. I'm in the circle now. Evelyn Lozada. Like that's how I felt. I felt like I was in the circle. Like I was, a, I, I was, you know, a factor. So, I'm really excited. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah.